Hi, my name is Kiana Sturtz. I'm from Pennsylvania and I am interning at Hands Off Cane for Elisabetta Zamperuti, who is a politician here and a member of the parliament. Basically what I do since this is a human rights company and they're just trying to abolish the death penalty, what I'm doing is research on specific states. I'll convert the statistics on executions to English and then I'll write articles for them for the website. I had the different interviews and uh, Kiana uh, was uh, the most committed person. Of course, uh, is uh, a relevant support for our daily activity to monitor news on the death penalty worldwide and also to produce reports uh, to be submitted to the United Nations. Hi, I'm Hannah Griffin and I'm currently uh, studying at Penn State University. Hi, my name is Samuel Knuth. I go to the University of Iowa and I currently work at Lake Chigonier this summer in 2018. I started off with researching um, for restaurants that we can partner with and finding all their contact information um, so that we can reach out to them. And currently I'm working on the Facebook page, I'm just hoping to increase our following and gain more support for the company. The work environment in the U.S. is very different and it's kind of cool to see how people conduct their business and the way it operates. So it's a great opportunity for someone to finally step out of their comfort zone because then when you go back to the U.S., you know, you have a lot to talk about with, you know, what was it like working abroad. So it has its benefits and I think it's a great idea for anyone to consider. We chose to have two interns from uh, IES program abroad because uh, we would love uh, to um, be international. People coming from another country have a complete different point of view and for us it's really important because uh, it helps us uh, thinking outside the box. My name is Maria Bluck and I study at Indiana University. Here in Rome, I work at Le Artigiane and it's a very special place. It's kind of an art gallery and kind of a store. They display and sell art from all over Italy. It's very women focused and it's all about empowering artists and bringing people together. I really love it here. Come into a new culture, even a new language, that's really tough for me to try to speak Italian all the time instead of English, but at the end of it, you are so ready for anything. You'll go back to your home and you'll be like, oh, a job interview in my own language, networking event in my own language, easy peasy. I'm usually the supervisor and it's always a, a good experience because they are very different from uh, Italian uh, boys and girls and uh, the, the thing that uh, makes me happy is that they stay here uh, more comfortable uh, every day and they like to stay with us and work with us. Hi, my name is Thorpe Talpas and I go to Texas Christian University and I am currently participating in the IES Rome program and I am working here at WordLift as an SEO and content marketing intern where I participate in blog writing and copy editing and all those sorts of things and it's been a wonderful experience. Besides all the pasta that I've been eating, it's been such a great experience and I love Rome so much. One of our um main markets is the USA market and uh, this is one of the reasons why we choose to have an, uh, an American intern. The experience of working with uh, an American has been uh, kind of uh, an open window uh, on uh, the American culture and uh, so she, she did a good job with us um, working as a link, as a bridge uh, to the American culture and uh, uh, open our, our minds. My name is Sofia Jaspik. Um, I studied art history at the University of Texas at Austin. I'm interning in a modern and contemporary art gallery. I've been doing a lot of translation. The first day that I walked in, um, they were preparing for the um, Gambelotti exhibition. Um, and I, um, my job was to translate the biographies and the um, 
the labels of all of the works into English. So that was a lot to handle, um, but um, you of course, you go into it and you have fun with it and the outcome is always fun to see as well. Um, and so um, there was also a show for it, the actual exhibition and the inauguration. And so it was just, it was just nice to see the, 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 the work that you put into it is actually a result. So that's one of the things that I would say um, to recommend to other people coming into um, Rome or in Italy in general, just to be very open about things and flexible. Um, you learn regardless of where you're, you are um, and the placements that they're given to you. It's definitely been an experience that I'll remember for a long time.